Hey guys, it's Shalisha and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Thank you for joining me again. I am finally back with another video. I know it's been a couple of weeks now, so I'm super excited to be back. First things first, if you're not subscribed, please go ahead and subscribe. Like, I really appreciate it. I appreciate everyone who is subscribed already. Like, that means the world to me. Like, you actually like me. <laughs> Obviously, from the title, this is going to be a haul. I purchased some things from Colourpop over the Black Friday slash Cyber Monday sale, so I got a few things and I thought I'd show you. I got some liquid lipsticks, I got some eyeshadows, and I also got um, some blush. So yeah, first things first, this is what the package looks like. All my good information on the front, and it has made in LA, it has fragile, blah blah blah, it's just a box. Oh, when you open it, it's super pretty. Like, look how cute that is. It's like super cute packaging. I've ordered from ColourPop before, and I don't remember the packaging looking like this. It could be because of the holidays, or maybe they came out with a collection and they had some leftover packaging. I don't know. And when you open it, it has um, two little cards inside of it. The first one says ColourPop, and it says thank you. It says hi, love. You have perfect taste XOXO color pop um, it just looks like a pre printed card that they sent out probably to a lot of people then you also get this color pop pamphlet now when I've ordered before I didn't receive a pamphlet like this so this is new to me um, I think it's actually pretty nice and then it has like um, their different products like their shadows their cheek lip products it has some tips and tricks for each product that you use this is what it looks like once you, you get to the good stuff they gave me a nice little thank you product it says sorry we're late xoxo colourpop and it gave me a free lippy stick it's crazy because i didn't think my products were late so i was like okay i guess thank you anyway so i want to open the free product first and this product is actually their lippy stick which is really good because I've never tried their lippy sticks. It was never really something that I was like gravitated to towards. So I was just like, I'll just stick with the liquid lipsticks. But it doesn't hurt to try it out, especially if it's free. This one's in the shade Silk. And it's a matte finish, which I like because I love matte lips. If you know me, I'm all about a matte lip. So this is what it looks like when you open it. It looks like a crayon or something I don't know it's like a deep burgundy shade so I'm gonna swatch it now I didn't swatch any of these products so I want to see how this is gonna feel I want to see how it's gonna look I just want to see oh that's cute it's almost it's like a nice cranberry shade I really like it doesn't really feel too matte probably isn't kiss proof which it isn't because I just touched it I don't know if it needs drying time though so next I'm going to go right into the products that I ordered I ordered four liquid lipsticks three eyeshadows and a blush so the first eyeshadow that like I had to have super shock shadow in the shade telepathy telepathy I don't know how to pronounce this this is what it looks like it's so freaking pretty it's like a chartreuse shade I think that's exactly how they described it on the website lime green with a gold sort of undertone oh, so pretty oh like I seriously oh my gosh let's see how it swatches girl do y'all see that I want to order five more. If you don't have this shade, go get it. Telepathy, telepathy, tilapia. Get this shade. Like, seriously. The next shade is called Game Face. I've heard so much about this shadow. I've seen a lot of tutorials where people use it. And every time I see someone use it, I fall in love. So, I dropped this eyeshadow just to let y'all know. But it didn't crack. It just kind of, like, shifted a little. So, I'm going to show you guys how it looks. So, it may look a little weird. This shadow is so pretty. It's like a brown, like a golden brown shade. Um, copper. Girl, I'm slow. This is a copper shade. <laughs> a golden brown. Oh my gosh, it's called copper. So I'm going to swatch that right here. Let's see how. She's cute. To be honest, I thought it would be a little more golden. I don't know. I just thought it would be brighter from tutorials I've seen on YouTube. It looks better. 
Now the last eyeshadow that I purchased was actually a matte shade, which I'm a little nervous about. I've never tried ColourPop's matte formula. Because ColourPop is best to use with your fingers, I was just thinking like, how am I going to apply a matte shade with my finger? Like, you know, most of the time matte shades are used in the crease, they're used in the outer corner. Like, how are you going to blend that with your finger? I just thought to give it a try. Um, I just said, why not? It's only $5. You really can't go wrong. So, this is what Paradox looks like. It looks more red on camera. Don't get me wrong, it is sort of red, but it's more like a deep a burgundy. That's super pretty. Like I said, it is brighter on camera looking at it in the viewfinder, but in person, it's much deeper. So this is the shadow and this is the lipstick. So you can see the difference. Now I'm going to move into the next category of products that I purchased. It's their Super Shop Cheek, their blush, and it's in the shade Swift. I got this shade because I'm running out of my favorite bronzer. Since I'm running out of my bronzing powder, maybe I can see how this works. It almost reminds me of Max Format blush, but Max Format is a little more red. This one's a little more brown. I feel like this could be a nice dupe for it. See, these matte products, when they're this creamy, it makes me nervous. So I'm going to swatch it, like, right here. It is super creamy when you're like picking up the product, when you, but when you go to like apply it, it sort of like smooths out and like becomes almost like a powder. If you're a woman of color um, and you have like a medium to deep skin tone, I think you could get away with using this for like a bronzer. So I cleaned off my hand and my fingers so that way we can move on to my favorite part which is the liquid lipsticks. The liquid lipsticks are the reason I became so addicted to Colourpop. Like, I suggest anyone who's looking for affordable liquid lipsticks to run to Colourpop. So with that being said, I have three matte lips that I purchased and one satin lip. I've never purchased their satin formula before. I've only tried their matte lipsticks. So. I can't wait to try this. I got one of them and it's in the shade Hutch. This is what Hutch looks like. Very purple shade. Ooh, that's so pretty. Oh my, yes. If you know me, you know I like purple, dark lips. And hello. The texture, just by me swatching it, you can tell it has like a satin finish. It's just like super mousse. Like, I like this shade. Moving on to the matte formulas. I only have three more products to show you guys and then we're done. Now, the next three products are actually products that I've repurchased. So, I already love these shades. The first shade out of the three is Lax or LAX. This is what Lax looks like. It's another um, burgundy shade. I'm just been killing it with the burgundy today. If you like brick or um, burgundy lips, definitely pick up Lex. It's a really pretty shade. So pretty. Like, I love Lex. The next shade is Kapow. This one, it pulls more pink on camera, but it's actually like a grayish, pretty much is like a gray shade. Looking at it and looking at my skin tone, you probably think like, okay, Julie, you're crazy. Pair this with a nice brown lip liner and it will look so nice. So let's watch this one right here. Like, camera's not doing it justice. It almost reminds me of Stone from MAC, but this one isn't as gray as Stone. They're related. They're cousins. So moving on to the last shade that I have to show you. This is my ride or die shade. This is my life. This is my favorite. Like, I will never stop buying this shade. If you know me, you know what this is. Like, you, you know what I'm about to show you. This is Guess. It's so freaking purple, it looks black. But it's not black. It's purple. You need this. If you like bambi lips, you like dark lips, dark lip. I can't even talk. I've actually worn these three in a lip swatch video. So if you want to see how these look on my skin tone and actually on my lips, I'll put the link to my fall lip collection in the description box. So yes, guys, that was basically it for the entire haul. I really, really, really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want to see me create a look using some of the products that were shown today, let me know and I'll film them. Just leave like a comment in the description box or you can just let me know what you guys want to see in general. Don't forget to subscribe if you aren't. I know I always say that, but please subscribe. But with that being said, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.